Hi, I'm Jeet from Espresso Tech Sales and Service, and today we're going to do a video featuring the Mazda Mini Electronic B. I'm just going to do a video overview and show you kind of where everything is and how to use it. So over here we have Bean Hopper. Uh, it's a shorter one, holds about 1.3 pounds. Uh, on this model though, there is a little screw that holds it in place, so you do have to unscrew it if you do want to remove Bean Hopper. But first, push in the shut off, and then the whole Bean Hopper does come out. There are larger hoppers available if you plan on using this in more of a commercial scenario, but short hopper is better off for prosumer use. Uh, just right below that is we have the stepless grind adjustment. Uh, it's a bit opposite uh, what you're normally used to, so it's not righty tighty lefty loosey. Uh, it's counterclockwise will actually get you finer, and clockwise will actually coarsen the grind. Um, and with it, I just find to do a minor adjustment. If you back your hand against it, you can just just minorly cheek the grind setting. That way, you get precise uh, grind setting adjustment. This is just a cover here over the funnel. Uh, this is where all the coffee grounds will come out. And again, it's an electronic doser, so there's nothing that's going to really remain. Some coffee grinds will stay here just because it's static and it'll cling to the chamber. Um, but in essence, what it doses out basically is pretty precise every time. So on it, you have three different modes of operation, or three different doses. <clears throat> on the left here, you have your single dose. Right here is double dose and then continuous mode as well. So to adjust your single and double dose uh, settings, you just dial in the potentiometer here. And here, you would turn it clockwise to increase the dose. Uh, you can get about four to 19 grams of dosing um, for each one. So if you do, you know, so you can do seven and 14, or if you overdose, you can do nine and 18 uh, for those grind settings. So the main power switch is over here on the right-hand side. And so just a simple, on off switch and with it in the on position I can demonstrate how it kind of looks when you have it running. If I click it once it'll just do the single dose, if I click it twice it'll do the double dose and if I hold it down the whole time it'll do the continuous dose or the manual dose. So press once, single dose lights up, if I were to press it again the double dose would light up and if I hold it down it'll do continuous and flash both lights. Also a neat feature with the new Mazers is that they have the new porta holder here. So the benefit of that is that you can actually have hands-free operation. So not only is the grinder single hand operation where you can actually just press it once or press it twice, once you do so you can actually leave your porta filter in place um, to grind right into. And then you have your little catch tray here. So the Mazer Mini Electronic B, the Electronic series is a little bit beefier than the regular Mini series. The Minis runs 58 mil burrs and the Electronics run a larger 64 mil burr. Same 250 watt motor, same 1400 to 1600 RPM, but the bigger burrs with the electronic dosing make it much more appealing for home users because that way you're going to get fresh coffee every time. So that's our little overview on the Mazer Mini Electronic B. Uh, thanks for checking out our video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And as always, stay tuned for next time.